Alright, um, this is Josh with Fully Lit. I wanted to show you guys the uh, engine block here I'm machining out. Um, this one got just got finished up, so all I have to do is finish cleaning up the edges here. Um, I do my blocks in three different stages, so I got um, basically my rough cut, then my medium cut, and then my fine cut, so it's really nice and smooth by the time I get done with it. Another thing that we use here is torque plates. So, use a, I use torque plates and a lot of guys I've seen on YouTube, they don't use a torque plate. So, um, anyways, when we bolt the torque plate down, do the honing and machining, and if it's machined right the first time, like I always do, um, I don't have any problems with my rings wearing out, and this engine will last a really long time. You can see how nice and clean, and there's, there's not rough at all. This, this end is That's really good to go. <laughs> so, anyways, this is a Rottler, uh, Rottler, uh, hone, hone and boring machine, so this is what, uh, what we use here. Um, so, I have these brackets being made right now. I've had a lot of requests for them. I'm selling them for 350 bucks. Um, the reason why is the ring is the D ring is actually kind of pricey. I have these made. Uh, uh, these ones I when I buy them they're, they're rated for 2,500 pounds. So um, they're double and a half of what the engine weighs completely um, ready to go. So by the time you put everything in here with oil. Um, complete engine weighs about a thousand pounds just just under a thousand pounds so uh, anyways I just wanted to show a short video show you what it looks like after I machine a block um, once this um, I just gotta clean up the edges here as soon as this one gets cleaned up on the edges uh, on the end of the uh, on the end of the cylinders I'll take it over to the uh, uh, to get it decked so I, I got another machine over there that will uh, we'll deck it out so Anyways, 